Like and subscribe, The Facts Drone. Google on 23rd of August, Tuesday, dedicated a doodle, to mark the 140th birth, anniversary of Weather Woman, of India Anomani, who played, an important role, in the field of meteorological, instrumentation. Here's what we know, about the noted physicist, and meteorologist. 1. Anamani was born in a Syrian Christian family, in Kerala in 1918. She initially wanted, to take up dancing, but later opted, for a career in physics. An avid reader, as a child, she had read almost every book, at her local library. 2. As a physicist, and meteorologist, Anamani has a number of valuable contributions, to the field. It was her research, that made it possible, for the country, to make accurate, weather forecasts. 3. She also published, several papers, on solar radiation, ozone, and wind energy instruments, which laid the groundwork, for India to harness, renewable energy. Thanks to her leadership, in the field, India was at, the forefront, of countries, where meteorological, data, especially, of solar radiation, and wind, were used, for studies of alternative, sources of energy. 4. Anamani began her career, with a scholarship, for research, at the Indian Institute of Science, Bengaluru, and worked with Nobel, Laureate, C. V. Raman, studying the optical, rubies diamonds, and rubies. 5. In 1945, she joined, the Imperial College in London, where she completed her graduation, in physics, and specialized in meteorological, instrumentation. 6. In 1948, Anamani returned, to the country, and joined India Meteorological, department in Pune, where her responsibilities, included arranging, meteorological, instruments. 7. She then took up a special interest, in developing indigenous, infrastructure, to forecast weather, in India. By 1953, Anamani was the head, of the division. Under her, more than 100 weather instruments, were simplified, and standardized, for production. 8. She held important positions, in the United Nations, World Meteorological, Organization. She also assisted WMO, headquarters, in revising the WMO, Guide to Instruments, and Observing Practices, and worked briefly, in Egypt as an expert, on radiation. 9. Anamani won the Insha, K. R. Ramanathan, medal for her remarkable, contributions, to science in 1987. 10. She died on August 16, 2001, in Tiruvannapuram, on her 100th birth anniversary, in 2018, in recognition of her legacy, the World Meteorological Organization published her profile and interview. In the interview, Mani said that she was fortunate to not experience professional discrimination in what was considered a man's world. She did not feel either penalized or privileged for being female. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe for daily update.